I'm going to show you how to use the Moody Tones presets inside Lightroom Mobile. I'm going to show you on a few different images so you get a sense for how these presets look in different lighting conditions. So I'm going to start with my image here in Lightroom Mobile. Once my presets are installed, they'll be under the Presets tab under the Moody Tones Presets folder. First you want to start by choosing the Auto Corrections preset. What this is going to do is guess the best auto corrections to balance your image, ready to apply the preset. Once you've pressed it, just press on the tick icon on the right. Now go back into your presets folder and start applying the presets. As you can see, we have lots of blues and greens in the shadows with warmer highlights. So I think for this, I'm going to go with Moody Tones 8 and I'm going to press the tick icon on the top right. Now we can go and start customizing if we want to. So I'm going to start by increasing the exposure a little. I'm going to open up the shadows and under the color tab, I'm going to warm the whole thing up just a touch and decrease the saturation. I think I'm also going to add in just a slight vignette just to center our attention on the subject in the middle. And there we are. So we have before and after. Let's try on another image. So we're going to go along to our presets folder, press auto corrections. The thing with auto corrections is it's guessing the best balance for your image, but it's not always correct. As you can see here, the image's white balance isn't quite right. So I'm going to go back to the color tab and I'm going to cool it down to what I think is a correct white balance. I'm going to go back into my presets tab and I can start applying my presets. We've got these lovely dark faded tones to these presets, adding the moody feel. I think I'm going to go with three. Again, we can go back into our settings, might open the shadows up a little, maybe increase the blacks a touch, increase the overall exposure. And I'm going to go into the color tab, warm everything up, and I really want to just correct her skin tones quickly. So we're going to go into the orange hue and make sure that the hue is right for the skin tones. I'm also going to turn the saturation of that down a little bit so that it looks right. And there we are, before and after. Last one I'll show you here along to our presets tab, auto corrections and the tick icon, then back into presets and we're going to choose one that's suitable for this image. I think for this one I'm going to go with eight. Going to go back, just increase the exposure a little, open up the shadows, maybe crush some of those blacks. Let's add a vignette to the image, just to center our attention on the bench. And if you're using a paid version of Lightroom Mobile, you'll be able to have the selective edits. So for this, I'm just going to put in a radial filter, I'm going to increase the feather on that, and I'm going to brighten it up where the window is. Add a bit of a shine. And there we go. Before and after. Welcome to the Moody Tones presets. 